like, comment, and subscribe. This episode of Let's Talk Jinx is brought to you by smashing the like button and make sure to subscribe, but also comment with your reply to this question, and that is, with Worlds coming up, let's pretend you are the AD carry for a team that is going to Worlds. As a Jinx player, what exactly are you hoping is the meta, and what do you hope your teammates play to best protect you on a professional stage? And the reason I'm asking you this question is because they say, and they being right, they want to make the game as close to professional play as possible, but obviously sometimes a little bit of disconnect between, say, solo queue and playing with four other people that have at least some sort of synergy with you. So ideally, basically, in, a, in like a dream team where everybody you're playing with has great synergy, even if they're not all about you, what do you want to play like in a comp with them based off of the things you've scene that's in the meta and stuff like that. So for example, if I'm playing Jinx and what's been the current meta in pro play, I'm okay with things like Azir and something else you know, being a thing, especially it seems like a lot of teams are playing through top lane, so Gwyn and Camille and stuff have been pretty relevant. I just am hoping though that if you are going to have me playing Jinx in any of these capacities, just don't make me pick first. That's, I know maybe that's a little bit of a cop-out answer, but like, don't make me, don't let us first pick Jinx in such a scenario, though. Like, we don't necessarily have to hide Jinx to the last pick, but we can't first pick Jinx in a world where things like Camille and Gwyn and all these diving champions are kind of meta still in other lanes. But I'm actually fine with it, basically a composition that sees maybe top lane is a bully that can maybe get the, a lane advantage with some ganking pressure uh, in the early game. And then the mid game, you know, you can have Rise even or Twisted Fate still so they can roam, maybe roam and gank top more often. Basically, top heavy the map. And then as Jinx, I'm like an insurance card. So if we can't snowball the game in the early to mid game through top lane, okay, well, went late game, I can scale, I can farm up, and then I'll just carry at that point, basically. Basically, kind of a, a well rounded composition instead of like a protect the Jinx comp where in pro play, on a pro play stage, unless it's an Ardent Sensor round two meta, that would be actually terrifying to play against five people who are well coordinated as a jinx a very immobile jinx so with that being said that's my answer what's your answer comment and thank you so much for watching this video again make sure to like comment and subscribe hit that bell notification the actual subscribe button but i don't know which video will be next because i can have a lot of kinks so until this time take care gg get jinxed thank you for watching and enjoy pizza responsibly